Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso here on SABC3. Our guest today, one of South Africa's most respected and revered stand-up comedians. He lives his life on stage through characters that he's created, leaving audience members in hysterics. Now, he's performed well over almost 15 one-man shows and received numerous awards. And now he's part of a star-studded cast that brings a show called Mass Hysteria taking place this weekend. Mark Lottery, good to have you here. Thank you. Good to be here. And I wasn't mocking. We were, we were serious. You are a believer. I'm a believer. For people who don't know what a believer is, <laughs> these are people who believe in Justin Bieber. <laughs> what, what's your opinion? You're actually a big fan of him. I, I, well, I, I said, uh, you know, everybody was dissing him, and then I decided to watch this, this documentary um, that, that, that he had made of it. And the guy works hard, yeah. and I think his work ethic is second to none. And I think people are just jealous because he's young and he's successful. And as I said to you off camera, there's a side of me still waiting for the scandal because we all love that. You know, we all <laughs> love the fact that, that Katie Holmes left Tom Cruise. We're like, secretly like, yes. <laughs> so, so we wait for the Justin Bieber scandal because you can't be that good looking and successful and happy all of the time. Um, but you've got your fair share of scandal too. Some, there's something going around that you are writing articles. Uh, what's it called again? Um, there are various articles that have been written and the latest one was uh, why colored scarlet be terrorists and there's someone writing um, using my name and saying that you know I'm the author have of you got your profile and picture and as well I got my pro great you profile see, you picture see it's proof. a great pic though <laughs> so uh, which is why you must always look great you never know when you're <laughs> gonna be photographed so uh, when those things come out I just tell people that I'm not the author of, of everything that goes around in the internet but but that's the electronic world it's dangerous and you've got to you know kind of control what's happening Very out true. there but it can also work in your favor so yeah. Let's talk quickly about this new show that you're part of. Huge yeah. lineup. Um, I think some of the biggest names in comedy right now in the country. Mass Hysteria. Mass Hysteria. Um, I think we are eight comics. Um, uh, you know, previously um, we did a show called um, Bafani Bafani, which yes, was very successful in mm -hmm. 2010, um, and um, which toured and went to London as well. Mm -hmm. And, and now we're doing um, this, this show called Mass Hysteria, which starts at Monte Casino in Joburg next week. Features great comics like Tumi Murake, John Flismus, Dumiso Linde, um, Mark Banks, um, Nick Rabinovitz, Kurt Squindra. Casper de Vries. How did you get Casper de Vries to come Koza. out of it? Casper de Vries, I think, is, I find Casper to be very, very funny. Yeah. Um, and um, so I'm so glad for the first time um, I think he's going to be joining a lineup of comics and being part of a comedy festival. So we're looking, very, we're looking forward to that. And that's Monte Casino next yeah. week. And then the 27th and 28th, it comes to the Grand Arena in Cape Town. And tickets <laughs> by Compute Ticket. Shoo! Yeah. Do, said, you want, do you want that's to? That's why I'm well, here. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> but like, each of you plays a different kind of minister. What, what's, what's that swing there? Because I mean, Casper is like the minister of Twitter. And what are you minister of? I'm what? minister of interior design, darling. <laughs> <laughs> with, with with hair design. like that, you definitely want him to be a yeah, interior designer. Yeah, I was interior design, darling. Um, and I think because, um, you know, the little thingy underneath Mass Hysteria, it says that the show's funnier than Parliament. So everybody's become a minister of a different department. And I don't know offhand what they are, but it's on the website under yeah. Mass Hysteria um, Funny Festival, Comedy Festival. Mm -hmm. And I think it's going to be, I think it's going to be awesome because yeah. there's lots of excitement around it. Um, and we're expecting, I mean, huge amounts of people. Lots yeah. of people have bought tickets already, so it's going to be rock and roll. But you're going about this pretty differently, the way that you're marketing it. I mean, I read up about it that John and his company, John Flismus, yes. you're taking the whole social media route uh, for it instead of doing the traditional promoter route. Why is that? It's, it's very different um, to what was done previously in that what John Flismus has done is, because he's one of the people, he's one of the comedians yeah. on the bill, obviously, and this time around, um, there's no major middleman in that um, John himself has taken this on board, so it's a kind of a project run by the comedians. We'll be running it on our websites, on our um, Twitter accounts, because um, people can uh, follow me What you me doing a lot Twitter. of these days, he's tweeting like, <laughs> in the scheme, in the scheme. What's yeah. in the scheme all about? I don't know what in the scheme's all about. Hashtag in the scheme. Uh, hashtag in the scheme. No, I, that, that, that's another story. That's a long story. <laughs> I'll tell you about that later. But, um, but that's what we're doing. So. With, with the help of social media yeah. and with our own with our own fan with our own followings, um, every comedian's taken taken it upon themselves um, to sell tickets um, without um, a massive or a big producer yeah. as such, cool. and that's what's very different about this festival. And thus far, it's proven to be very very exciting. Oh. I think it's a very interesting shift.
And I must say, dude, after years and years, I'm still loving the hair. It's looking amazing. It always just manages to look the same every time I see you. I don't know how you do it. It's amazing. It's, it's, amazing. it's, a, it's a great wig, and um, <laughs> it's a very expensive wig. Um, so so don't, don't try this at home, folks. <laughs> do not. All right. So we are giving you the opportunity, uh, Cape Town viewers and Joburg viewers, to win double tickets to go and see Mass Hysteria. All you have to do is SMS the keyword WIN, your name and your city, to 33728, and you could win that. We'll also find out a bit later on why Mark doesn't work on Sunday. Sundays. He's got something against that, working on Sundays. But anyway, right now, crossing over to you, Kia. Stay with Espresso and SABC3.